Former journalist Anish Sheikh is the main man behind Pakistan's first artificial intelligence reporter. Having worked in newsrooms and in the field, Anish was always looking for a way to make the job less taxing. The idea behind this AI writer was to make a software which can write news reports or content by itself. We started uh, this project in 2009 and we wanted to make a writer and we soon discovered that it is very hard to make a writer and then we sort of changed our plans and we started instead writing a reader, uh, a software which would read the way you write and when it has read uh, say 1000 articles written by you or me or any other person, uh, it will just replicate the style. People were skeptical of his plans, but he remained committed, invested 50,000 US dollars, and also roped in three other co founders. Dante was soon launched, named after the famous literary artist. The AI reporter works by assessing daily news headlines and grading them positive or negative, and then combining that with hard market data. Uh, at this moment, it is writing Pakistan Stock Exchange closing of about 350 words. Uh, we do a sentiment analysis, which is the outer layer of this uh, product. From that outer layer, we get the sentiment analysis and the basic news which can potentially or are affecting the market. Then it comes to a writing engine which we have developed. Uh, what it does is, on the basis of the data that it has and the sentiment analysis from the outer layer, it makes a news on the closing of the stock exchange. As the stock market closes for the day, he gives us a demo. Which is going to run this module and say how quick how, the time that it will take to uh, go to uh, the final step. And that's it. PSX down by 369 points as traders keep selling. This is your uh, headline. These are some of the analysis of, let's say, equities log 1.4% last week as the country lost ground in the rebasing of MSCI emerging market. Like global trends, the Pakistani media industry is also downsizing and Dante could be a substitute. Three media houses have already approached the startup. Monthly subscription starts at 1500 US dollars and goes up to 50,000 US dollars depending on the services chosen. While many journalists feel AI could help the process, they remain firm on the need for human involvement. Threats are always there whenever we have any kind of technological development, any kind of change. But the main issue is that we need to counter the threats and there is no technology in the world which can actually counter the human brain. The makers of Dante, while recognizing the value of human touch, claim to do away with something bigger, bias reportage. The people who can write are opinionated, to say the least. Uh, we are trying to make a module which is not biased, which is only uh, trying to base its predictions or writing on the facts. Dante and other AI reporters have the potential to change newsrooms and challenge reportage. But despite the strength of the software, it needs to be seen if biases can really be kept out.